Hello everyone and welcome again to another Q's View video. Today for my collection we have a third party MP scale version of Perceptor. Uh, this is Spotter which was released from Fans Toys a few years or so back. And there we go. So there it is. You have all three bots that came together in a box set. All the pieces to make the camera. Real quick trivia, if you know what their actual names are for each one of the bots, let me know in the comment section down below. I do know. I'll give you a hint. One of their names ends in the letter O. <laughs> and one of them ends in the letter S. And I'll let you guys figure out from there. I don't want to give it too much away. But yeah, they're all, they're all great. But I really like how these turned out. Uh, they're not full of a bunch of die casts like usual fans toys, but they still hold up well and they're feel, still feel sturdy. The plastic is, is pretty good quality. And in my opinion of, there's a few companies that put out uh, their version of Reflector. Make Toys did one. I think X-Transbots did one. Can't remember who all else. But out of the ones I saw, these were the ones that caught my eye the most. I think with the other companies being a fairly close second or third in the running nonetheless but yeah i really like how these turned out i like the color scheme on them and uh, they're pretty durable figures you know well i don't you know i'm kind of one of those collectors where i don't keep everything on the shelf all the time i do pull my figures down quite a bit mess with them transform them whatever they don't they're just they sit on the shelf a fair amount of time of course but they don't always just sit there but uh, this is what a good set I know this is a set that a lot of people are having a hard time getting a hold of wishing for a, a reissue for because he sells really high on the aftermarket uh, that late tax is a huge gouge for a lot of people and it's a pretty big amount because this set can be pretty costly I don't know how much it's running for now these days um, on the uh, after seller markets but I know it gets pretty expensive. So I'm glad in I got in on it when I did. And I'm quite happy with it. Let me know if you have this set or if you went with another company's. And if so, why? Or if you like this set or how you went about that. Or you don't yet have a reflector set and you're not quite sure who to get. Or you want this set but you don't want to pay ridiculously high aftermarket prices. Which I can't say I'd blame you. All right, well, there you go for my collection today. Uh, thanks for watching. Till then, stay safe out there. And I'll have another video got for you guys again very soon.